Sometimes it's good to be minimal. Hey everyone, Dylan Schumacher, Citadel Defense, and I am back from a SNS Training Solutions class. It's a one day night fighter course. And I wanted to share with you uh, one of the lessons I learned, which is that the Spectre chest rig, and I'm sure there are other chest rigs who can do this, uh, but, but my chest rig that I ran um, is very good for running just a minimalized loadout. I was uh, pleasantly surprised with my own chest rig, uh, if I can say that without sounding too arrogant, uh, was very, very happy with how it performed and just wanted to share that with you. So for most of the class, um, you know, the, the longest I was ever away from base was like three hours. So I didn't really need to run a ruck and I got by the whole class without having to run a ruck. And so this is basically what I did. Um, you know, I have my mag pouches, right? The most magazines I ever got issued were four, but even in real life, right? You can still carry up to six. Uh, I had water on the chest rig, right? So I had a liter of water and I just ran that. And whenever we left base and I needed water, well, that's what I drank. Uh, when we went on the longer night op and I knew I was going out, I prehydrated, right? I drank a bunch of water before I went, that helped. So then I could just, again, just get by with just the canteen, which was, which was helpful. Uh, over here, I actually didn't use this pocket at all. This does have my thermal in it, and I did have that on me the whole class, um, but I actually didn't, I ended up not using it. Um, so, but I had that. I had that as an option that I carried, so I could always do that with something else. And then of course I have my IFAC and my dangler, and then my two, my two tourniquets on the sides. Uh, I did, again, I still have my radio on me, uh, ended up not using that, honestly. Uh, I had a buddy who had a radio, but he ended up not clipping his on. So we just ended up not, not running radios. But I had it on me the whole time. Totally could have used it. And that was it. That was my rifle. And that was really it. And this really, I was, again, I was really pleasantly surprised that I was able to get by for the whole class and even this, this night mission. Uh, without a ruck and was very happy about that because I always like to carry as little stuff as possible. And so this just worked out as a really, really slick, minimalist, you know, loadout that, that I was very, very happy with. I will say too, I will be honest, I did run this uh, Helicon Tex uh, fanny pack and I don't really didn't use much in here, but like there was stuff in here like band-aids, right? Or batteries. Um, in case something went down. I had an orange signal flag in here. Like, just, this was just kind of a little, this is a water purification kit, which I didn't really need. Um, you know, some chapstick, like just kind of some odds and ends, some lens wipes, a permanent marker, um, things like that of little odds and ends, some duct tape uh, that I had on me. Uh, this has a blade in it, actually. This is a, uh, some kind of fold out blade, a Rook, Rook, Rookie? I don't know, some Chicom thing that I got because uh, Gideon Tactical recommended it. R-U-I-K-E. Uh, I've had this thing for a while. I kind of like this blade, actually. It's kind of a nice nice deal. But usually that'll just ride in my pocket because it has a pocket clip. But all that to say, odds and ends of just kind of little things that I needed, right? I technically don't even need that because I do have a fixed blade on the kit. Um, so that's one thing that I did have as kind of a supplement. But between those two things that worked, even when it came to nighttime stuff, I just clipped my night vision onto my helmet and that's how I ran it, right? So I didn't, I didn't have anywhere to store my nods or whatever, they just lived on the helmet. Now, you know, maybe you don't like that, maybe whatever, but I was able to get by them without a pack. So again, super happy with the minimalist loadout that I had for this, worked really well. If you have a Spectre, I would go ahead and tell you to try it, give me your feedback. Uh, if you don't, you should get one and then you can give me your feedback. But Super helpful. I like the idea, again, of being able to run as little stuff as humanly possible. And I had a lot of success with this chest rig. So I hope that gives you some ideas on how to set up your kit and make your life less burdensome and more joyous. Do brave deeds and endure.